big change. That's what we're playing for here, uh, is the concept of big change. Not incremental, but a sea change. Something that's truly disruptive and that can benefit and serve the generation to come. Brian Parker, uh, and I'm a 2014 candidate for mayor of Oakland. My campaign, among other things, is about innovation. So uh, we're having uh, a two-part event here. So it's a meet and greet and fundraiser for me, uh, but it's also the introduction of Bitcoin uh, and the use of a, a fundraiser for a mayoral campaign. Innovation. So clearly we're going to talk about Bitcoin. But innovation means that sometimes you take a chance because you see that the benefits outweigh the risk. And if the benefits are so big, they can change an election. And if the benefits are big enough, they can change the city. And if the change for the city is big enough, it can change for a generation. Brock Pierce, who's the chairman uh, of the board of GoCoin, and I uh, worked together uh, you know, probably about five years ago. So when I started this endeavor of running, uh, Brock was one of the people that I reached out to for support. Uh, he was supportive right away. Uh, and then over the months, uh, we started a conversation uh, because he knew about one of the one of our mantras was technology and innovation, because uh, that's a part of the world that I come from. Uh, and so over time, he says, uh, what, "What about doing a, a Bitcoin uh, fundraiser?" What is Bitcoin? Why is it interesting? Think of it as peer-to-peer -peer money. It's uh, it's the people's money. And uh, in America, we still have a lot of people that don't have bank accounts and have a difficult time getting them and they're the ones being taken advantage of more than anyone. And I think that Bitcoin can change that and enhance the lives of those people. So from my perspective, Bitcoin is going to touch a, a great number of industries and have a very positive impact on, on people. We have a, a, a jobs plan that talks about creating 20,000 jobs by the year 2020. Technology is going to be one of those sectors. Clearly, as Bitcoin and if it continues to emerge, can be an important catalyst in the growth of that technology sector, the sector that will provide jobs and good living wage jobs uh, to Oaklanders across a number of socioeconomic classes. But what about this concept of innovation? Well, I go back to this concept of equity. Brock talked about this. As I look out at the city of Oakland, it is a tale of the haves and have-nots, the rich and the super poor, the hills and the flatlands, this is a city mine where there's 15% unemployment, 30% in East and West Oakland. And if you're an African American male in one of those places, it's 70%. The San Francisco Chronicle ran a four part series a couple months ago and said for an African American male, you've got a coin flips chance that by 18, you'll have graduated from high school or that you'll be shot. So we look here and we see um, we've got to do something big. We've got to do something disruptive. And so in addition to my friendship with Brock that had been longstanding, when I started uh, thinking about Bitcoin and what the promise of it was, here was a chance to innovate. Here was a chance to take a big, bold step and be the leaders that we have to be to help out a bunch of people who haven't historically been banked. So now what does this mean? That people aren't giving away a third of their paychecks to have them cash that people are able to pay their bills online and exchange money back and forth. We can also create a culture of saving. And what we want to do as a city, we want to save. And we want to reinvest. And we want families to be able to reinvest and to do that. That is our call to action. Who wouldn't want that guy working for him? It's pretty darn good, huh? Uh, you've had a chance to see him. I know we're a long ways uh, uh, from Oakland here, but uh, uh, I think we have an opportunity to invest in, in someone uh, like this that can bring about the type of change that we're talking about. So if you haven't made a donation, make a donation. And uh, from a Bitcoin perspective, if we want to be a constituency that matters, you do that by voting with your wallet. And I want to get behind you know, people like Brian that are recognizing that this is innovative and supporting him in every way we can. Where this starts for me uh, is my deep love of Oakland. I grew up admiring the city. I've lived in the same house for 14 years. Uh, this is where uh, I want to raise my family. I have a deep love for this city, and I start off with a passionate heart uh, around trying to embrace the core values of this city uh, and to improve them and to, to deliver open and being everything that it can be.